Hey guys, this is Chris again, coming at you with another video. Today's video is not really a video I necessarily wanted to do, but I know a lot of you have been asking questions about it, about why I'm gone from LB as well as a few others. Now, I won't uh, speak on their behalf because they can speak on their own about what happened to them, but um, this is not a video I ever thought I would have to make. I thought I'd make LB a career. Unfortunately, it didn't go that way, but I will always regard my experience there. Um, as priceless guys, I got to basically do my dream job for almost two years now, and I do, and, and don't put the hate comments on LB or Roman or Adrian or anybody like that, guys, because I do still talk to them every once in a while. I do still consider them mentors, even though Adrian is nine years my junior, he is a great stand-up dude, and I learned a lot from him, so that's definitely something I can never forget. And now the context that I made there as well are contacts that I would not have ever made at working at Lowe's, Walmart, wherever else. So that experience as well, um, I, I do have a job lined up. I am studying for the SIE and I will be doing Wall Street stocks. So a former client of mine is uh, hiring me. Shout out to you, Scott. You know who you are. But um, he bought three watches from me. Uh, basically what had happened was they transitioned from wholesale. It was about 67% wholesale. Which, as you know, wholesale was a lot of my sales, guys. And then they transferred to mainly 100% retail. So I, I transferred that out. Started going on uh, Instagram, posting every day. Thank you, Nina. Thank you, Nolan. You guys know who you are, guys. I still talk to those guys, too. They've helped me out a lot with my channel, guys. It, and again, that's uh, one thing I can say about LB. They say it's a family-like environment. And I, like I said, I know I can still get a hold of any of them. Anytime I need anything, and they did treat me well, Roman treated me well, even after I left, guys. He did some stuff that most businesses wouldn't have to do. I won't even say what it was, but he treated me well in the end, even though it's something I didn't really want to do or leave, but it was uh, it was time to go, I guess. But um, basically, sales are down across the board, guys, and a lot of the dealers will pretend like, oh, everything's fine, everything's peachy, but uh, basically, sales are down across the board. Doesn't matter where you are, guys. But um, that's basically the gist of it. Uh, why I'm no longer LB. I was let go. I didn't leave on my own, guys. So I just wanted to clear that up for my long-time viewers. So I appreciate you guys for sticking around. And to my new-time viewers, I hope you guys stick around as well. I will still be doing content, guys. I will still be making videos. And I do plan on... Actually, I am starting to sell pieces as well. So if you guys are looking for a particular piece... Feel free to reach out to me. I'll leave my Instagram and my phone number down below so you guys can actually reach out to me. I actually just saw my first piece outside of there as well. But um, anyways, guys, that's the gist of it. Uh, I don't want to go too much detail. Like I said, don't leave the hate comments down there, guys, because LB's been nothing but great to me. Even after I've left, guys, I still keep in contact with most of those guys. And I wish them nothing but the best. So anyways, guys, this has been Chris with a quick little video. And we will talk to you later. Bye.